to set a tone the second half. And uh, we did that, and um, we just got to maintain that. Not, not to bring up a sore subject, but when you got hit there, uh, did, did you think, I mean, how badly did you think you were hurt? And did you, I mean, you came back in pretty pretty quickly after that. Uh, they, t they Initially, they took me out because it was my fourth foul. That's why they took me out. Uh, I would have stayed so in. So you would have stayed in if it wasn't yeah, your fourth foul? I would have stayed in. And, uh, but it was my fourth foul, so they took me out of the game. But, um, I mean, he just caught me with a knee in my groin. So, I mean, I know it wasn't too bad. It, just had, it hurt for a little bit. just had to bounce back up. You guys have kind of grinded out your last two wins. At this point in the season, does that kind of feel like it's your all's identity? Uh, I mean, we like to run up and down, but um, I mean, we do whatever it takes to win. So we got grinded out and win, and we'll do that. And uh, but, uh, we like to get up and down. Emmanuel said that that's the way Cal wants you all to play. What do you think is key to kind of being a team that can't fly up and down the court? I'm just getting rebounds, getting stops, and uh, getting the outlet and just running. I'm sure you, uh, answered this already. What do you think has been the biggest reason for the slow starts past few games? Um, then we just all got to come out focused. Uh, can't give up easy buckets early. That's, that's all I mean. Ashton said he thought maybe thought maybe you guys celebrate a little too much. You know, when you score early in games. And, you know, <laughs> what do you think? Um, I mean, I really haven't been paying attention to that, but uh, maybe, maybe that maybe that is something we, we should take note of. How well, what goes through your all's minds when you fall behind? And I think it was 16 to four today. What, you know, how do you guys process that? I would just stay poised, stay focused, and uh, just stick to the game plan. And uh, we just stay together as a team and just do what we're supposed to do. And um, I mean, no matter what's the, what's the score, uh, we knew as long as we just play, play how we know to play, then we'll be straight. What's your injury report? I'm fine. <laughs> Ashton, you have a funny play-by-play -play of what you said when you went down. Ah, uh, too, too, too. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, but, uh, yeah, I got hit. But. Were you serious about where you got hit? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Is that the most unusual way you ever walked off the court? Yeah, <laughs> definitely. You sort of waddled. Yeah. Was, that was different. What did I, Kenny say? He was like patting you on the head. Uh, he a lot told, of sympathy. He said you're gonna be all right. <laughs> Was your voice much higher pitched after that? <laughs> Maybe a little bit. <laughs> Along with that collision, there were a lot of hard hits, you know, dives to the floor, stuff like that. Was that probably the most physical game you feel like you've played since coming here? Uh, I don't know. I mean, we definitely uh, matched that physicality. Uh, I think that, uh, I, mean, I don't know, to be honest. It looked from above that there was tension building it you know sometimes especially when Nick went down a couple of times took the elbow um, was that felt on the court as well I mean I want to say we just kept our, our right state of mind uh, we just go out there play basketball do what we do we fight we compete and um, we don't really get caught into the dirty plays or the elbows or anything like that I mean we just go out there and play and do what we're supposed to do we don't try to pick up any stupid fouls or anything like that were you eating gummy bears on the bench at the end of the game? No. no it's not what were those? They Gatorade twos. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Same difference, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Talking about um, celebrating earlier, would you argue that maybe that actually brings more energy to the team? Uh, yeah, a little bit, I would say. I think uh, once we get out there, our personalities start flowing. Uh, what happens, happens. And uh, we just be ourselves and just whatever happens, we just go with it. How would you describe your personality on the court? Um, loud. Just, I mean, yeah, it's a lot of basketball. I mean, it's loud. It's got a lot of energy. What do you think is the biggest thing you've got to, you personally, have got to do better for this team to kind of keep taking steps forward? Um, just get my teammates involved more. Um, just make it easier for them. Because uh, I mean, if, if I make it easier for them, then they It'll end up being easier for me. How much does Emmanuel making shots all of a sudden sort of change you guys? It helps a lot. It takes, uh, I, mean, I mean, it's good that he's in shots. He works his butt off every day. So just to see him in shots, see him falling is great. Pretty easy guy to be happy for? Yeah. Like. yeah. 
That's my guy.